Well, welcome to day four of Icewind Dale. This is the Enhanced Edition. We're very new to uh, the whole D&D scene uh, of play, and it looks like this game has definitely got a lot of um, uh, Dungeons and Dragons based to the mechanics and gameplay and stuff. And if you haven't watched any of the earlier videos, uh, go back and maybe check some of those out. I think I did go through a lot of the stuff, um, just what the game mechanics are and options and stuff like that as I'm learning this game as we go along. So, um, yeah, let me know what you think. Any comments, uh, leave them below. Let me know there's anything else you'd like to see or you have anything to say about what I'm doing here if you know the game or just in general so uh, the last video I realized I did not save it didn't save after the last fight so this was one of the last fights we did um, on day three and we're getting ready to do it again um, change the formation around I actually <laughs> I actually changed some stuff around I wasn't familiar with what was going on and I um, came in to restart and I stuck our wizard here uh, Alana out in front and she literally got smoked by the gobbles before um, the gobbles even made it up here uh, I like every single one of them somehow she ended up in front and every one of them shot her with arrows and killed her before I even realized what was going on so um we restarted we changed the format we moved her around so she's not out front so with this formation i'm trying to get the main uh heavy armored uh people out front and everybody else out back um seems like a little bit smarter of a play going into combat and stuff so um, we're gonna go ahead and get going oh on pause there we go so we want to come back what are you doing Oh, jeez. And we did it again. Somehow we had her selected. I keep forgetting that. Okay. Come on, lady. There we go. Oh. Good enough. Now, there was a auto loot. Yeah. Some kind of auto loot function, like right here. We click on it and quick loot whatever um, something else I realized when I went to start <clears throat> fighting here our uh, cleric slash ranger here I think he can use a shield um, which I'd like to get him in a shield if we can because <clears throat> he is one of the three people I'm gonna have up front just to try to absorb some of that uh, initial damage from attacks and like I said again I am quite new to this whole format um, you know obviously some basic D and D or I mean D and D some base well yeah basic D and D education from years and years and years and years ago I never got uh, hugely into the whole thing so I'm not really sure what kind of shield he can oh so you know what we should do Hopefully my wireless mouse here doesn't puke out on us. I got a new mouse coming because for some reason I cannot figure out why this mouse does this, but it's just constantly lagging and just I, I just I look I've read and changed everything I possibly can on it. So it looks like he can he can take a medium shield. Why well, there's not a large shield? It seems like. Didn't, uh, what's his name here? I oh, can't see his equipment. Never mind. Um, <clears throat> so, small shield. It is armor class plus one. Yeah, it's strength. That's what it requires strength 12. There's a buckler. 
so we're going to just check that out uh, again being new to this i'm trying to get more familiar with this all right i can't stand this mouse doing this to me only does it when it's not plugged in so it's using the wireless but like i said i just cannot figure out how to stop it i can't literally done everything i can to Oh, get this damn Logitech mouse, and it's a very expensive mouse. But, anyways, um, his strength. What is his strength? Where's our, where's our stats? There we go. Strength sixteen. Wow. Eighteen ninety three. Eighteen fifty eight. I don't know what the double uh, slash digit e thing means. Um, maybe for another time. So, anyways, we're good. He can buy a shield. I don't know how much that's really going to do, but hey, it makes me feel better. All right. Would you like to buy something? Yes, I would. Um, medium shield. Prevents him from, well, now damn it. A small shield is usually round to carry one of our group. Permits the user to carry other items in that hand, although he cannot wield or carry another weapon. <clears throat> I don't understand what that means, but we're going to go ahead and just go with the medium shield because I think it does offer protect protection from missiles and him being up front I can't sell right yes um, that's mainly why I want him as as armored up as he can get so leg two All right cool I think <laughs> I hope so oh <laughs> uh, yes 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 well, let's go fight some gobbles and have some fun <clears throat> actually feel like we're getting somewhere today so what we're gonna try to do uh, strategy wise is They all took some shots at us. Can you guys please all just get in the damn line? Oh, I do not know. I do not know. I do not know. Come on. All right, so she has darts and she has chromatic orb. I don't really recall what chromatic orb means. Um, the bard, she's singing her song. Everyone's got their music buff for combat. Um, it's the only problem with her, though, is... What does she have equipped? High quality. I think she's got the mace equipped. And... She got oh, or whatever. Yeah, I think she has uh oh, plus the daggers and mace. So weapon style bonuses. What was it? Slashing it. I don't know if um, daggers are slashing or not, but, well, hell. So we're going to go ahead and let her attack. Um, so one, he's going to attack. Two is the 
priest. He's going to attack three. Um, I'm going to let the Bee Slayer guy attack on them. Four. Um, Alright. So, one. Two, three, four, five, six. We're gonna. Did she cast? I don't even know if she cast. Oh, yeah, we're just gonna have her throw her darts. Damn, I keep hitting that instead of pausing it. Boy, he just can't seem to take that gobble out. There we go. <clears throat> so now I think we're on the AI. So after you tell them initially what to do, yeah, look at that, like quickly. Sweet. Um, Priest got a little, little banged up there, but not too bad. Way better now that we have some gear. Um, so I think we're just gonna take all this stuff, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, we're going to go ahead and gear back up. We're going to head back into town. Let this little kid know we got his stuff. Here's your fish, boy. He says thanks. Yep, cool. A little bit of experience, and we're all good. So that's that. Uh, I'll check the map here. That's hmm. That must have been that option. The way this is all blued out. Um, that's where you can go. I don't know. Do we want to go or do we want to maybe explore a bit more? Our priest cleric, I keep saying priest, but our cleric has, um, he has one healing spell, so, I mean, we run into something, and so far I think we're in fairly decent shape. You know what I need to do is I need to swap these two, because she's an archer. That's it. Okay, well, I suppose, um, quick save successful. Oh, well, that's it. Wasn't too hard. Not much of an ex adventure after that, but I got here stop. We have F2 is attack, talk, um, so this is the end. Yeah, it's the end. So <clears throat> might as well go in and do the rest thing real quick. Hundred ninety three. So I'm assuming that all your gold just yeah goes into the total pool. All right. So we're gonna go ahead and talk. Quimby. Ooh, I wanted to check the counter. I didn't check the counter for how long this goes on. What was it? One day, 16 hours. Yeah. He rested for eight hours. And she's detecting traps again. I'm pretty sure we already went through all this stuff. Yes, it's all been opened. Okay.
Pomebs and Porium. Was it here that we, uh, get my, oh, come on now. Get the clicker on there. We're gonna go ahead and uh, sell to dude here. <clears throat> Battle axe. Oh. I don't know what the gems are for. Oh, I can sell it just yet. He has a scroll case too. Scrolls, that's what I was thinking. So, um, she's got a gem for him. Oh, look at that. Sell, 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 sell. Okay, you just click on everything. What does she have? Longbow? Damn it. I'm almost sure she's got a long. So, arrows. High quality dagger. She has a oh, short bow. Can you buy? I don't know what I'm thinking. Long bows. Cross composite longbow. That's what I was thinking. Four. She has four of those. I just sold her one, I believe. Um, that go plus one. Oh, is that gonna add? Oh, thief. Yeah, she can't. Can't use it. Alright, because she's a thief. Oh, that's weird. What is she then? She's obviously using one. She's a fighter thief. She's using it though. Modifications. Oh, that's so weird, but you know why I have her using it? She has a double plus for short bow for proficiencies. Does this, is this making any sense? I have no idea if this makes any sense or not. <sighs> Missile adjustment plus three to missiles. Hmm. Yeah, I'm just. I got a plus two for proficiencies. I mean, I, I, I don't know. I'm I'm kind of confused on this one. So we're just gonna leave it kind of. We're gonna leave it alone. She seems like she's doing good. All right. So um. This is the bar that's a tavern fishmonger I don't know let's go check out this fishmonger I'm a little curious as to well met stranger Gasper the fishmonger what can I do for you that's because it, it, it isn't my home. I may be a fish farmer. It doesn't mean I hawk fish like some street vendor. He de deals in knucklehead and scrimshaw down at the shore. 
Droid, what? Knucklehead trout. It's a rare fish found in the lakes and towns. Must make a decent amount of coin. It's an honest living, probably from trade. I have an important transaction that works as a speak. What sort of transaction? The town's food stores are running dangerously low. My warehouse foreman, Sharon, tells me <clears throat> that there are not enough food to last through the coming winter. I've arranged trade at Galloway. We'll keep our stomachs full well in next year. The caravan's due to arrive any day now. Oh, yeah, this gets into the caravan that, um... With secondary windows. Not doing me any good for that. I don't like having to scroll these words, but anyways. Yeah, Rothgar told us of the cavern, caravan. Search it out and see it safely in East Haven. Okay, we met Graspers. Oh. Well, then, by all means. So, basically, he's, uh... He's got trade coming in with the caravan, and the caravan's also, uh, I believe, the same um, caravan that Rothgar was asking us to go deal with. So, oh, that was the boy that we saved the fish from, or saved, killed, and got his fish for. Um, I believe this is Rothgar's house. Yeah, it's Rothgar's house. This is a temple, temple Tempus. So we're gonna we're gonna run over here real quick. I want to check out the temple. Where's there? Sleep, reflected image, chromatic orb, and armor. Where's chromatic orb again? This spell creates a four inch diameter sphere that can be hurled to its target. The orbs depends on the wizard. Level one wizard is 1d4 damage and blinds a target for one round. Okay, that's not too bad. Sleep. Sleep causes slumber on 2d4 hit other than on da 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 da. I suppose. More. With five or more hit dice. It's not the stuff legend may have taxed against magically. Sleeping opponents never miss. Although they will awaken after the first hit. Oh, so you know what? Sleep seems like it may be more important. Or more useful because at least it'll be asleep and not attacking. Um, being blind for one round don't really do sh stuff. Okay, I had some questions. So let's shop. We're just shop healing. Here's donate. I don't understand why. Why? why what, what's the purpose of donating? Someone help me out. If you watch this, comment, tell me, please. It's a point. Donating. Identify. 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 Oh, man. I thought... Oh no, he hit it. There's just there's one in the gem bag too. So that's <clears throat> not for just gems. Uh, potion of healing. 75. Oh man, that's some serious coin right there, man. So I think we're uh yeah, we're we're good on all that. 
so you can heal or you can rest and heal what about resurrecting people I wonder how we bring our beloved party members back from the dead So we're going to go ahead and do another quick save. We'll go down here and talk to this lady we found. I think she actually had a quest of some sort. Where's our journal? Oh, is this? That's a scroll. Journal, journal, journal. Okay, done quests. Important events. Okay. These are ones we did. Don Quest Quest. Alright, so we got the Fishmonger Supply. Rothgar has to find missing caravan out of Caridon Navelle. It's carrying valuable supplies. The South Bridge out of town in search for the caravan in the hills along the shores of Lake Denishir. We are to return to East Haven and to Rothgar, either with the caravan or the news of the mis mysterious fate. Okay. The dream song. Oh, this is what we were talking about. This, I did get the quest from her. We encountered a strange blue-skinned woman upon the shores of East Haven. She spoke in song and she seemed pain, but we couldn't understand her. There must be something drawn her to you, but we do not know what. Okay. important events so um all right we're gonna see if we can talk to this weird lady again i just don't like that okay the woman da, 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 sorry my moments i'm feeling past and one looks at like you hopefully I don't know. I don't think being a jerk to her. So, okay. Who in the hells are you? What are you doing here? Okay. The woman looks pain, but she does not respond. <sighs> yeah, I don't know, man. I don't want to say anything. Maybe we'll, because it's in our journal. Quest, important event, quest, the dream song. I don't know. We'll try, try talking. Oh, you know what we need to do too is open up Gorse, his uh, inventory here, and there's a gem bag. Open container, two container, two container. Jeez. I knew there had to be some way to do that. All right, I don't see anything else. Oh, what is that? Question mark. Question mark, question mark. Various fishing poles. All right, guys, come on. Someone's blocking the doorway. Yes, Absol. I was helping him with this problem. You know, I'm kind of guessing that it's someone, it's going to be, if anyone's got any answers, it's going to be someone in the damn inn or something like that.
gonna help you with something. Of course. Where's how? Do you know where I can find Rothgard? Can you tell me a little about the town? I don't know. They all say that. Can we use a rhino sword? Plenty of rooms available. Da da da. Yeah, they're not saying nothing. I thought I'd put my phone on vibrate, but <clears throat> all right. We're gonna go run back to the end here. This blue lady thing is kind of bothering me. That's a fish monitor. That's a tavern. Oh, what is this? Jonan. Hold on. They said something about a song. Jonan, Jonan. Which one's Jonan? Oh, come on. Chilzo, Amando. Jeffy. Squirrel has nothing to say to me. Okay. What was... Come on, you stupid thing. This is irritating. Jonan. Oh, Jonan's right here. Alright, so... Jonan. Hmm? Oh, sorry, friend. I didn't see you saying their name's Jonan. Something I can do for you? Are you all right? You seem preoccupied. I'm surprised you saw me as deep into daydreaming as you seem to be. Your time might be better spent fishing in the lake than your dreams. No, 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 I'm fine. Just taking in the view of the lake for a bit, trying to shake these dreams out of my head. The lake's beautiful, isn't it? Dreams, usually those fade upon waking, friend. Mayhap a day's worth of fishing will chase them away. Ah, uh, well, the dreams have been fishing in me of late, friend, so much so I can barely catch a wink before they rouse me from it. A frustration it is at times. Sometimes it seems like they're more real than waking world. What kind of dreams, you say? Well, there's a woman, and I don't, and don't give me that A, that I to... It's not like you think. She walks upon the surface of the lake as if it were flagstones instead of waves. She doesn't say anything, just sings beautiful songs, but I can't understand a word. Hmm, I think I may have met this woman by the shores of the lake. If truth be told, friend, I the damn it, there's no sense to it. These dreams are eating at me like starving wolf. I can barely hold a daily thought in my head before the memory the dream hounds its way back in here. I, by the hells, I don't know how much more of this I can take. Hmm, the woman by the shore didn't seem threatening, but, well, let me see what I can do. Eh, you're not playing on man's hopes, are you? I'd be grateful for just one night of peace. I'll see what I can do. If I think of anything, I will return. So, hmm, see, I just noticed him saying that. I know I've talked to him before. What have we got? 35 minutes now? Strange blue skinned woman. Let's go and talk to her. Bam, this woman has a skin like that. But you have no idea why. She's talking. That song, Are You Woman? That Joanne Jonin sees in the streams? Jonin? Yes, Jonin, you are the woman from his dreams, aren't you? 
Yes, yes. Have your eyes fallen upon him? Do you know where it is he walks? Now she's talking to us. Yes, I spoke to him recently. He sees you in his dreams, but he doesn't know what you want of him. What do you want? I am of the calling Alicia of the sky's mirror. My heart is Joan's. Joe Mins, but he cannot see me in the flesh, or else I will become as the currents upon the shore. A gift do I have for him from one of his blood long ago, who also held my heart, but not as Jonin holds it now. Many reflections of the moon have come and gone since the day in which the one of the blood of Jonin fell beneath the waters of the lake. He fought the last of the great white serpents that swam upon the northern winds. The Queen Mother, Ikasaract, I, 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 sure. who now lies without life on the bed of the lake. A promise was made, and I must honor it. The one from whom Jonan comes asked, I see his blade return to those of his blood. If the Queen Serpent, I, I, <laughs> I kiss... Sarak, I could Sarak, drink his life. She did, but not before he dealt her a mortal blow. From the depths of the lake, I have brought the fire-shaped steel that ended her life. It is intended that it be belonging of Jonan now. So you wish to return the sword of Jonan's ancestor to him, but you cannot because the sight of you will make you stream away to water. It is one of the laws in the lands beneath the lake's mirror. Will you give this to Jonan and tell him my heart? My songs are his, my heart is his. I will see to it this blade is returned to no Jonan, Alicia. Here, then I entrust this to your keeping until your path crosses with that of Jonan. Return when you have given it to him. I must know if it has found its way back to its home. You tell her you will. Farewell. Okay, cool. Well, we're getting somewhere now with this quest. Do 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 do. Talon's person, Jonan. Where be thy Jonan? There we go. Hmm, A, eh? oh greetings to you again. Forget something last time we spoke? Jonan, I think I found the reason for those dreams you are having. A, eh, you're not playing on man's hopes. One night of peace, blah, blah. The woman in dreams is a sea spirit. Her kind speak through song, which is why you can understand her. A sea spirit, eh? What does she want? She's one of the spirits that like to see to learn men to their dad's jump. What? Well, that's just, I don't understand. Her name is Alicia. Speaking through dreams is one of the talents of her race. She speaks to you because she loved one of your ancestors and has carried a promise for him many, many years. One of my ancestors, why come to me then? Your features remind her of him and your heart is as strong, if not stronger. She has come to love you, but she cannot let you see her in the flesh. She wishes to give you something that belonged to your ancestor if you would take it. A, hey, I will. Of course I will. Sorry, it's well. It's a bit much to be laid upon a fisherman all at once. I will. I'd be honored to accept anything she wishes me to have. Here you are then. It's the blade your ancestor used against Is. I Kaseract, the last of the white dragon matriarchs. It lay within the dragon's heart for almost a century at the bottom of the waters. Carry it well and know that Lys loves you. Your dreams shall trouble you no more. By the spine of the world, even shattered, this blade's a wonder. But no, more dreams, you said. I, well, I'll miss them, actually. Her song's beautiful, simply beautiful. Ooh, I shouldn't, but I should, I should have looked at the blade while I had it in my possession. Didn't realize that. Maybe it would have had some more lore. I'll tell her, Jonan. Farewell. Boom, 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 boom. 
um, I think somewhere along that whole thing, yeah, we got experience. Um, trying to think uh, no damn it um kit description oh yeah there we go uh but what i was looking for was um what's the uh classification for like being lawful or evil or whatever um just curious is if it matters who is talking to an NPC, um, whether you know their their classification is. Um, I can't. Oh, right there, neutral good. Duh. All right, chaotic good. Neutral good, lawful good true neutral true neutral chaotic neutral so for the most part yeah everyone's not so i guess i could see that being why some of that's uh going the way it is um trying to figure out all right so right there experience level one next level is 2000 I am not gaining levels uh, that quickly at all uh, but it's getting split up between everybody and I'm trying to figure out how it gets split up um, so he's got over a thousand and he's only got 500 He's got over a thousand. She's got a thousand. Five hundred. Yeah. So I don't know. I don't know how that gets split up. But um. So I think. I think that was it. I think we've got everything else. Pretty much completed. Unless I'm just flat out missing something, but. yeah okay so i think that's it we're, we gotta pretty much head out to the caravan now um we're on 43 minutes i th come on you stupid ass thing um bridge south of town not really Sure's where you just oh maybe that's it to the hills. You just head off to the edge of the map or something. So We're going to go ahead and quick save and load over.
Aha. Ooh, wolf. In uninjured wolf. <sighs> so we're gonna do this. Um one, two, three, and we're gonna go five. Damn it. Okay. Um five, we're gonna hit. And that would be good, I think. Oh, I can't see. There we go. Yeah, we slaughtered them. Come on, get out of the way so I can see the stupid wolfies. Yeah, no loot. Okay, you don't get... It don't be anything from the wolves. Is that is that a caravan? I'm just gonna kind of check around here and map, 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 map. <clears throat> so these are abandoned in the snow. What is this? You know, I just realized I do not have any sound. something to listen to all right so what do we got here no yeah just damn it just stop with this nonsense all right there we go so one what is this guy fork fork so two three so two all right Oh, I'm going to put her on him too. We'll see. Oh, yep. Okay. So six. We're going to go ahead. Six, 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 six. There's six. Um, oh, shit. Where's her spell? You can't tell me I got a freaking. Oh, did I already use it? She already used it. Son of a bitch. What else is she gonna do? <clears throat> Alright, well. Man, you guys make quick work of all that. Container. All right. Man, more of these guys. All right. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. Damn, I wish I had, uh,
trying to take. I don't want. I don't want archers taking out <sighs> my clothies or anything. So we're gonna send the fighters in um, on top of them. Try to draw their attention. Oh man, he got a little whacked up, but not too bad. Ten to fourteen. Check it out over here. What? Damn it. Oh, I did it again. <laughs> I gotta watch it when I'm selecting this stuff. stuff is going which I mean he's got the most um carrying capacity I suppose yeah 320 150 250 so yeah we'll, we'll be all right we'll uh grab some of this crap on him arrows yeah, we want her to have them. Whoa! Shit. Oh, we just walked into a... Alright, I'm gonna take them all. Well, maybe let's let's walk. Let's run back here. Get out of sight of ranged. Damn it! Holy shit, man! These rangers are. Uh, Hmm, this is a uh, strategy or turn-based or whatever too, I believe, so I don't know how much running really <clears throat> makes a difference. Well, let's get everybody kind of... Alright, one, two, three... And then we're going to go four and go. I can't see these guys. That's six. Let's try that. Are they hitting them? Yeah, they are. They're hitting them too. I don't know how I feel about her being right there. Okay, we're going to take, um, let's take the old dragon slayer guy. Have him go tank him for now. Oh, look at that. He waxed him good. Shit, yeah. Oh, wrong button. So, yeah, I got all my hotkeys bound all goofy, but um, I wonder if we can rest now here like this. Look at that. 
You just can't rest in towns, which I guess makes sense. Why would you rest just anywhere in a town? And No. Just curious if it had any. <clears throat> um, weight three. Was it a short sword? Must be a short sword. Yeah. Um, I was just wondering if uh, the staff might have had um, magical properties or something like that. Not really sure if you like you got a mouse over them to or right click them or whatever I mean to see if they're any kind of like you know buffed items or something like that I guess. Oh, there's a hole. This is pretty freaking cool. I'm gonna come back this way. Let's see what's over here. I'm at a dead end. All right. What do we got here? Oh, we're going on an hour. So what do we got? We got protection from. Could it just? Give him I gem, fire agate, gem. I oh, was just gonna have her take those for now because we don't even know what the heck those are. So I don't know if this is Five, six, and then one is a uh, defend guard. Let's try. Let's see what happens. Oh yeah, that arrow. Cadrio. Oh shit. Man. Freaking orc. Orc. Orc got him good. Got some good. Cure light wounds. Cadrio. I, I, I have to say, I have to stop here and say, I more and more I play this game, the more and more I love the mechanics of this gameplay because it's it's almost like pen and paper because you do the game does operate under those those abilities in that fashion with the, those kind of game mechanics um but it also it's giving you that time to stop and and do those things but it's you know in a, in a sense almost like a turn-based game but in a more real time, I guess, if that makes any sense whatsoever. Um, I'm gonna have the priest pick it up, pick it up. Create spirit to be intact and unopened. Yeah, nothing, nothing doing.
I think he's the most well armored one is Cadriel, right? Oh hell that oh her bard song has not been playing. Damn it. I ain't no good. So um five we're gonna yeah start out with our not sure how they target people either you know so in all honesty <laughs> I think just sending the armored guys in first is how you anticipate that so we're just gonna tell everyone to attack oh shit um And four. So we're going to let them guys wrestle with them, but we're going to... Oh, they already destroyed them. I feel like we're going to find something down here. Like bad guys. Fork. Fork. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and just go ahead and start. Holy shoot! We got this guy, man. Son of a gun. So. You know what? I wonder if I can put him to sleep. Um, so we're going to take everybody and attack him. Except for six. She's going to put the big guy to sleep. Ogre. Did she put him to sleep? Ah, oh, damn. Barely injured. Cool. All right. Um, do we just let him do? We just let him attack. Yeah, let's just let him attack. Well, we're gonna put. We'll, we'll put on everybody on there and then we're going to take uh, the archer and her I feel like there's two of them over there oh yeah there we go so we'll just take everybody in. oh man he just why are you attacking him? Why would he attack the cleric? Two hundred seven. That was a nice one. I almost want to hear him saying all this dialogue. <laughs> Felicia, level up. All right, cool. Well, we got someone level up. Felicia's the yeah, the bard. All right, what do we got here? Um, we got a potion of healing. Caravan contract, Morning Star Gold, and we're gonna go ahead and he's gonna pick that up. And then 
our main man here. So we can go over there and pour what is this winter wolf pelt. Well, there's certainly much more to explore here. Um, I think we're going to call it a night. Uh, this is a little over an hour now, and um, we'll finish up the caravan cave next episode. So, yeah, hope uh, hope everyone enjoyed and learned something or got what you came here for. Anyways, uh, leave a like thumbs up the video subscribe and if uh, you have something to say or you want to leave a thumbs down uh, just let me know why and any general comments or questions or anything you'd like to see or you know think I should have done differently let me know but uh, yeah have a good night and thanks for watching